Great Rivers Greenway, your regional park and trail agency wants to know, where should the greenways go next? As part of their strategic planning process, they want to hear from you. All you have to do is visit greenwayplan.org to learn more and take their quick survey. These are your sales tax dollars at work, so let your voice be heard. Plus, you will also automatically be entered to win a $100 gift card to the grocery store of your choice. That survey closes February 6th, and again, the website is greenwayplan.org. We've been having a blast in our continuing series, Get Out on the Greenway, sponsored by Great Rivers Greenway, to really encourage viewers to get out and explore, to enjoy the landscapes of all four seasons that we have in our area. And today we're highlighting the Sunset and Boschert Greenways. And joining us is Ann Milford from the organization. And thanks so much for being here with us great today. Great to be here. It is great. We've had a lot of fun really exploring St. Louis. What does Great Rivers Greenway role in our area? Okay, so we are the public agency that's connecting the St. Louis area with Greenways, St. Louis City, St. Louis County, and St. Charles County. And you all are really uh, connecting people, places, and spaces. You really are the connectors. That's right. right. That's what a Greenway is. A Greenway is a uh, open outdoor space connecting people and places. So it's usually a paved trail with, um, there's restrooms, uh, drinking fountains, benches, all those things you find along the way along with conservation projects as well. So when speaking of some of those trails, the Sunset Greenway is a 3.9 asphalt trail. Tell us more about this one. Okay, so the Sunset Greenway is in Florissant, Missouri, and it's uh, beautiful on one end. It uh, connects with Sunset Park, which is right on the Missouri River. And then on the other end, it connects you to um, some historic sites, the St. Ferdinand Shrine, but also Old Town Florissant, which has got all sorts of really charming historic homes, shops, restaurants. I mean, you could spend an entire day just kind of walking in downtown Florissant. And it is really beautiful. I loved having an opportunity to explore the shrine, see that piece of living history right here in St. Louis. And the winter solstice is tomorrow. If it's clear, it'll be a perfect way to go and enjoy a sunset, right? Yes. <laughs> yeah, now they're doing a little work in Sunset Park right now, but it's just an incredible place to uh, watch the sunset and you do see why it gets its name. There's no question. And it's beautiful. <laughs> we have some pictures for you. So we'll make sure you have access to all that on our website as well. But in addition to these beautiful views of the river, you can also ride your bike, enjoy shopping, dining, a lot of other amenities along this green, yes. right? Yes, there are. Um, different parks and schools along the way. Um, the Old Town Florissant uh, Community Organization, they have special events, food truck festival. So, you know, kind of keep an eye on the calendar. Um, at greatriversgreenway.org, we'll post anytime that they have any uh, fun events in Old Town Florissant. Absolutely, and if you want more of that history in the area, you can also go download a self-guided walking tour from the Old Town Florissant Partners. It's on their website, and it's also going to be on our website as well, studiostl.tv. We'll make sure we link all of that for you, and it really does connect you to just a beautiful adventure in downtown yes, Florissant, right? absolutely, yeah. So that's the Sunset Greenway, <laughs> yes. and then last week, you and I went to go explore the Bosher Greenway. Tell us all about okay, that. Okay, well, we had a blast with that one. I think um, one of the most unique elements of that Greenway is the giant 30 foot uh, bicycle sculpture. <laughs> it's a it's giant beautiful. flower made out of bicycle parts. So that's really fun, but it's sort of um, set up on top of a bluff that overlooks. Um, the Missouri River Valley and the bridge, the 370 bridge, it goes back into St. Louis County. So that's St. Charles County. Um, it, the Bosher Greenway connects you to Fox Hill Park, which is about a 25 acre park. They've got some interconnected lakes, um, playgrounds, and then you and I walked along the um, storybook walk, the St. Charles City County library changes that book out every single month. They've got several storybook walks in St. Charles County, but the one in Fox Hill Park changes every month. And it's cool to take the kids out to really enjoy that storybook, get them active. Yes, you can walk and read a book and you can enjoy some beautiful scenery. And I think many parents uh, and caregivers, especially this time of year, uh, are looking for some free, fun outdoor activities to burn up a little steam with the kids. Burn off that energy <laughs> so they can go to That's sleep right. later at night. That's right. And I, what I love about this, and there's that bike sculpture right there, but what I love about this Greenway is it connects you to so many different places, yes. right? Yes, it takes you from um, the Newtown community in St. Charles County 
all the way into um, sort of the French town area of uh, historic St. Charles. So that greenway will drop you right down there. It also connects you to the Katy Trail. So you can build your own adventure and decide you can go further into old St. Charles. You know, and there's bike racks. You can walk. It's not just for riding bikes. I always want to emphasize that. <laughs> um, you can also head over. There's a walking and biking path on the 370 bridge that takes you to another greenway in St. Louis County, the Missouri Greenway Earth City Levee. So uh, on our website, we have um, these downloadable adventure guides that you can plan an adventure, whether you want to walk just a half a mile or you want to go for a long adventure. Yeah. And you can take all of these adventures now or you can jump start into 22 the right way along a lot of the greenways right here in our great, greater St. Louis area, over 128 miles of greenways. So get out on the greenways with Great Rivers Greenway and we'll make sure you have access to all of their information. It's right there on your screen, but we'll also post it on our website. It's studiostl.tv. And thanks so much for being here. With Thank us. you for having. Of course. Don't go anywhere. We'll have a lot more Studio STL right after this quick break.